This is the story of how a keyboard got me a free trip to Los Angeles and into a party hosted by one of the biggest esport orgs in the world. And it all started December 2021. Wait a minute. That's too far. Here's a quick recap. Basically, I became a content creator on TikTok, made a bunch of tech videos, started making videos on a keyboard from this company called High Ground. After making a bunch of videos, they invited me to join their High Ground partner program. They flew me out in May to see what products they're working on. And a few months later, I got an invite to the opening of a High Ground pop-up shop and a party hosted by 100 Thieves, which brings us to right now. All right, welcome to my first vlog. It's 4.30 right now. My flight to LA takes off at like eight. Pretty sure I'm like an hour away from the airport. So I think we're just gonna head out now because it's better to be safe than sorry. I am pretty excited to go back to LA though. One, because of the weather. Two, I get to hang out with creators all weekend, which is so refreshing. F the ads, f the ads, f the ads. And three, I get to go back to the 100 Thieves compound and just have a good time. <sighs> I'm tired. But uh, Let's head out. Fair warning, this is my first vlog, and the problem is that I forgot to vlog. So let's just consider day one to be a quick recap. Anyways, I landed in LA, met up with Maddie, Kay, and Rillo. We got some sandwiches and also met up with our boy Jayhawk. After checking into our hotel and a quick outfit change, we're off to meet the boys over at the 505 podcast. Put your finger under while it's on the table, okay? It has to be off the table, and then you can go. You just go ham. And the goal is to not dent it. So you want to keep it as pristine as possible. No. That was terrible. It's okay. It, it's pra <laughs> practice makes perfect. That was, <laughs> that was terrible. I'm I mean, surprised you could I mean, we spilled half the fing drink. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that's way harder but, than I thought it was. But you did not dent it. You get a 5 1, dude. 5 1. I'll say, you know, welcome to I'm five terrified, five. dude. Oh, yeah. That was. I was way harder than five. I saw you do it and I was like, oh, that's, he did it so, that's perfect. Oh, it's dented. Oh, yeah. Oh? You know what? You came, you saw, and you conquered, and that's what matters. Did I do it? Let's see what we got here. Not going to spoil the full score here. You're just going to have to go check out the full episode yourself. But before we dipped out, Figgy had some gifts for us. Okay. All right. I got a bunch of Lakers shit you guys can pick from. What's this? Damn. This size XL. This is a work practice shirt. What size this? This is a large. Okay, large, large is promising. Large. Surprise for you. Yo. What's up, long sleeve? I'm the Lakers. I'm drunk. Oh, and to end the night off, we got too many drinks. But now it's the next day and the morning of the party. But first, breakfast time. All right, we just had some bagels. Uh, we're gonna head back to the hotel and then grab our stuff and head to the compound. I'm here with a bunch of the other high ground partners. Mr. Vio, this guy, <laughs> Joe, Maddie, and Mr. Chow. All right. We got to the compound and it was already pretty busy. I don't know where else to set up the tripod. I'm kind of just in the middle of the whole party, but uh, it's hot. Here's essentially what the event had to offer. Land stations for some Valorant, even Vinny and Nate shot Ransom games, the high ground Dragon Ball Z pop-up shop. This is essentially the reason why we were flown out here in the first place. But they got all the Dragon Ball Z stuff. They got hoodies. They got shirts. They even got a section for you to test out their new performance keyboard. And that's what Matt is doing right now. They got a giant screen outside to watch VCT, a beer garden to have drinks and hang out, and a bunch of other random things. And even though we stayed for the majority of the event, I can't help but feel like we hid in the VIP area for most of it. I mean, I guess it's mainly because it was the only quiet spot you can actually hang out and talk to other creators. But eventually we went back to the hotel to get ready for dinner. What's good hammer? I was joking. Hi vlog. It's me. Who said it's me? Mario. It's the old man. It's me. Dance. <laughs> look, look, you, you like his shirt? Yeah. Look, turn around. He's got his age right on the back. Hit him with, hit him with that <laughs> dance, Rilla. Hit him with that dance. Oh! oh. I said, saw you dancing on Instagram. I don't remember whose story it was. Yeah, I saw Man, it. I'm on a story? 
it hasn't hit me yet that like we get flown out to these events and just have fun with other creatives. I'm not in that mindset to where I feel like I made it, but I think that that time will come soon. Right now, just trying to vibe out. We're about to go get some Korean barbecue, so we'll see y'all there. I don't know what I was looking at. I don't think I saw it. You didn't get the clip. What, what did you just do? So today is August 26th, which is Joe's birthday. It's not actually his birthday, <laughs> but we, John just told the waitress that it is his birthday. So they're gonna come over here and do the little birthday chant, but he has no idea what we're gonna do it. I mean, look at him. He has no idea. He has no idea. Come on, no. Hey, no, Oh, that was great. Oh. Happy birthday, Joe. I can't wait to celebrate your birthday when it really comes around the year. <laughs> you know, I met I met him today, but I'm glad I met him on his birthday. <laughs> they just gave me a birthday present. Stop dreaming, start doing. Let that be a message to you. Happy birthday. Stop dreaming, start doing. As cliche as that sounds, and even though it's not Joe's birthday, I think that message can pretty much sum up this entire trip. I've always dreamt of being a content creator and I only started officially giving it my all two years ago. But in those two years of actually doing what I've dreamt of doing, my life has changed so much. I mean, being flown out to LA, being invited to an event held by 100 Thieves, spending time with creators who share the same aspirations as you, it's all surreal and it doesn't really hit you until it's time to go home. So if there's one takeaway from this weekend, stop dreaming, start doing. Happy birthday, Joe. Olive Garden is one step ahead of lean cuisine, and they charge four Which is also price. fire. Dude, imagine if you're at Olive Garden, and they're grating the cheese, and they say, <laughs> say when, and you, you never say when, and then they grate the cheese all the way into it fills up the entire world and everyone dies. Dude, I f, I f with <laughs> Olive Garden. <laughs> Do you? <laughs> Hashtag ad, hashtag sponsor. Hashtag ad. Six